Somalia is at the front line of climate instability in East Africa. Floods, droughts and conflict exacerbated by ongoing environmental degradation, unsustainable land use and widespread deforestation all contribute to making Somalia the second most vulnerable country in the world per the Global Fragility Index. Communities in the Chevelle River Basin know this all too well. They have experienced recurrent and severe flood events in the last three years that led up to over 650,000 people being displaced from their homes in 2020 alone. Samin Wijta, why Hamoku Iribo, Lich Bilon, the Bianca Arab, Lich Bilon, the Avara Lagar, and even Han Arke Lich Bilon, Bio Mel and Lich Tegno, Anagola, O Green Carne, had then a Lich Bilon, the Kali in Holy in Bilani Old Mane. That kid will be on the money. Oh, man, to Avar Tiuba Neda Marcas Akijut. That kid will have son or no show. The happy son of Murno will be on Murno B. Carno. Halis Liker and Murkamishes will look at the way you are to see the battle with them. In the face of an uncertain future, protecting the natural resources that sustain livelihoods plays an important role in building the resilience of communities to future climatic shocks. We are urgently needing a better understanding of these conflict climate environment linkages, and we need to prioritize the problems of soil erosion and environmental degradation. With this knowledge, we can design sustainable floods and drought risk reduction actions that build food security and resilience to future climate shocks. In Somalia, the UK government, the United Nations Food and Agricultural Organization and the United Nations Environmental Programme are supporting the government of Somalia to design nature-based solutions that reduce flood and drought risk and helping communities to cope with future climatic shocks. The project involves construction and strengthening of critical flood mitigation works to protect communities and livelihoods using sustainable nature-based approaches and building on substantial infrastructure gains made under ongoing programming. It will support a newly established national flood and drought task force with access to improved data, information and tools that inform decision-making in responses to extreme climatic events. The data will also inform long-term objectives on climate adaptive solutions to help vulnerable Somalis in the face of an unpredictable future. ولكن <تصفيق> We have seen here that we have seen 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 The sustainable management of ecosystems and climate hazards is a prerequisite for peace and resilience in Somalia. By focusing on innovative and science-based approaches to climate that recognize the central role of restoration and protection of the environment and ecosystems, Somalia can make a move towards a food secure and resilient future. That can you add the Ulipton. Marka Karashati had the way behind Marble Bukar for Behela. Like him, what in Wahla Tabakaro or Tajibala and Ugatagna Dutti.